Good day, everyone, and welcome to this, the grand and wonderful episode 47 in our series of Sim Airport. We've just started off down here. We're on level two of our East Terminal building. And as I said at the conclusion of the last episode, I would come back uh, into episode 47 when we had completed the extension of our eastern runway up here. That's true, and I've done that, and here we are. And I also said at the end of that episode that, oh, look, we could extend up here to get it to the 240 feet that it needs to be. We do actually have to buy some more land. But then, you know, you know, that when I was just thinking offline, I thought, what about this? Costs the same amount of money, but if we go down here for that extra, and I'm not joking, 10 feet, <laughs> 2 million dollars for 10 feet, sure. Uh, we might get to play around a lot with this, with our buildings down here, because we haven't done anything down here. Um, and we're also going to be in a position to play around up here because we now have a lot of space up here that we can muck around with. So that's actually looking pretty exciting for us in the future. In addition, in addition, we are also going to work on our sales reps, our first class lounges and our flight crew lounges. Um, oh, I don't remember that being a golden dollar sign. Maybe. I don't remember. Okay, but now from memory, I believe that in order to be able to assign one of these facilities to an airline, you needed eight services coming in from a single airline. So what I'd like to do is just go now at the beginning of that episode and figure out who's closest to that number and work on them to get them up there. So there's a six. Well, you know what? There it is. That's the six. That's the closest. So we're going to have to make Ford Air our number one priority for a wee minute. So Ford Air's got an EAM coming in, but what size are you? You are a large. Oh, that's good, because we want more larges. Okay, so we're going to put an EAM, which is going to our extra large gates, as it turns out. We're going to put you right down here, like so. There you go. You now have seven. We need one more from you, and we can get a uh, a rep and some officers assigned to you, and you're going to love us, because we're just the bee's knees. Um, I want to get an extra $2 million, because we're going to spend $1.8 million expanding down here. Then we're going to have to extend the runway, change the taxiways uh, so I reckon another two million in the bank do I reckon another two million no we don't need a million spare do we oh do we tell you what if we get up to we need another million million and a half 1.5 million so we get to 2.7 million that should see us tidily through so let's just um, speed that up. And while that's speeded up, we'll go and we'll find out how things are going in terms of passenger satisfaction. Gosh, we've got, we've got more yellow. Whoa, look at the frost. Where's that coming from? Yeah, but, okay, what causes it? Game. You're not telling me what causes frustration. Hmm. 
Okay, please, please explain frustration to me. Do we know what boredom is? Thirst is pretty straightforward. We know that. Hunger, we got. Bladder is, ooh, bladder. Really? Hello, frustration's gone down. Environment's gone up. Bladder. Bladder and hunger. Packs decisions, packs flow. Visualize the effect of foliage. Ew. That's not so good. That's the ground floor, isn't it? Yep. That's the second floor. Man, that's awful. Wow, we're going to have to do something in there almost immediately, if not sooner, uh, because that really is awful, especially in the first class lounge. How about one there, one there? Hmm. How about one there, one there? And one there. Uh, we might... Wow, that's awful there too. Well, I don't... Oh, well, I think we're going to have to put a statue in there. A decorative statue, per chance, may be the way forward, he said. In fact, it might be that we need one right there. And another one right there. Just to make sure that everyone has the utmost happiness in their life when they're walking to and from escalators. Hmm, okay. 1.5 million. Well, we've got a long way to go. We're up at full belt. Hmm. Let's go back and check our airlines again. See what's happening in there. Well, we could add some more. Um, I think we probably should, if we can. Um, now, the AN is the sky noon to five. We've got some space in there. The Super Alliance rates us at 62. Let's just go down to one for a second and see what you are. Oh, wow, we've got quite a bit. It's a large one, too. So we're going to take you and put you right there. We schedule you to there. Yep. Got any more? Nice. Who are you? Atlantic Air, what are you though? You're a small, I don't need any more smalls at this stage. Starflight PM is a large. Starflight PM is a large. Yeah, we've got some room there. Yep, we can fit one in. I accept your proposal. Now, um, why are you all the way over there? That's better. Okay, good. All right, that's two extra flights coming in. That's going to increase our money. Uh, we need to go back up to full ball because we're going to be here for a while if we don't. Right, this is still looking a bit dodged down here, isn't it? I think we uh, we need to do something with this. Because now we're on the ground floor. And we need to keep things running along just nicely down here. So there's nothing wrong with a bit of decorative decoration. That's what I always say. Decorative decoration. 
Uh, and then if we go back up to the second floor again, that's looking a lot better. Although that's red as anything, isn't it? And what's with this? Oh, no flooring. All right, first class lounge. Let's put some flooring in. That's what it is. Objects construction. Do you want carpet in a lounge? Um... What about Fluoro 5? How do you feel about Fluoro 5? I'm going to go with you feel great about Fluoro 5. Just fantastic. Just the bee's knees. Cool. Um, right. 1.2. Hey, eh? Did we lose money? Oh, we probably just spent a bit. Right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think the thing to do is to um, go to the magic of the edit and just run the game until we get to the $2.7 million that we need to begin our next uh, operational upgrade. So I'm going to see you uh, seconds from now. Uh, at the other end of this edit. See you soon. Good day, everyone. Well, welcome back after a very brief interlude. But we now have 2.9 million gazoolies in the bank. So, what are we going to do? Well, we're going to do exactly what we said we would do. And we're going to expand down here into the 1.8 million dollar bracket to extend our runway so first of all let's go right ahead and purchase the land bang and the game goes away and does savey things and then comes back so that's good so we now own a large parcel of land down here so what we need to do, I think, first off, is uh, get rid of these fences for a start. I like to get rid of the fences. Uh, let's take the... You know what? No. We got caught doing this before. Let's build a fence first. Very sensible. Um, because once that fence is built, then we can remove the other one and we won't have enormous security issues come up and bite us on the element of our bodies on which we sit. Uh, that would prove unpleasant. So we're just going to go ahead and do that right away. And we're not even going to schedule this other two here for removal until we see our wonderful guys come down and actually build this. Because we've been caught before and we will not be caught again and that's interesting he ran right over that guy uh, stuck why not stuck anymore I don't know why I've never come across a stuck before forced departure I think yes hmm Uh, that doesn't look particularly good. What on earth is he doing? I think we might have to come back to that. Let's speed this up because I want to get the guys building this. Um, ah, there he goes. Don't know what that was all about. But there you go. Ah, here they come. They're coming down this end. Novel. Okay. Actually, what's a new section cost? 2.2 million dollars. Mm -hmm. That's not particularly shabby either, is it? Okay, uh, well we we need to be getting along with this, so we'll build this up. Uh, by the way, it might be worthwhile just mentioning while these guys are doing this, that when I did the edit, I did nothing else but watch the game and waited until it got up over the 2.2 
eight million. Um, I thought the extra couple of hundred thousand dollars wouldn't go astray, and quite frankly, it was given the time it took to get up to the two point uh, seven. Uh, the extra two hundred thousand wasn't that long in coming. So that um, there's that, and that's good. Hello, where have all the workers gone? Fascinating. Oh, they're over there. What? What? <laughs> Everyone form up in neat ranks and then go and do something else. Whatever that was, I have no idea. But it, it looked kind of interesting. Now where are they going? Down here. Ah, complete the fence. What a great idea. I'm glad you guys thought of it. Um, because once the fence is complete, we're going to tear this down and then extend our runway this way. Um, because then we can do wonderful things in our airport. And we all want to do wonderful things in our airport. Actually, the, um, the area that we've taken up is going to be quite large, actually. Hmm. Exciting, really. Okay, we're almost done here. And in fact, we're so almost done, we could almost be done. Yep, I reckon we could now start removing fence line. And I choose you as the first person to go. Do, do, do. Moving from the right to the left. And we are dismantling. Excellent. Who doesn't like a good dismantling? Here you go. And they've already started to dismantle things. I'm going to take out the second row now. Moving, lo lo blah, moving from the left to the right, and then once this is done, we are going to extend our runway. And there you go. Uh, we've got one point one million gazoolies in the bank. That's we, we must be doing pretty well financially to be able to sustain that, I think. And there it is. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're going back down to one speed now because we are about to do something. What has happened? Why don't we have a secure area? Seriously? Where's the secure area gone? Oh, please don't tell me it's just that one there. Really? No, it can't be. Surely not. No. Nope. Do we have to do another row inside? Maybe we do, because there was two rows in the last one, wasn't there? There are passengers and people wandering everywhere. And my question is, why? You guys should not be out and about all over the paddocks roaming around in an airport. Please don't tell me it's because we needed two lines of fences. Could it have been that little gap there? Possibly not. Okay, well, anyway, while that's going on, I thought I was going to be clever and not have the security problem, but I've caused it anyway somehow. Um, let's extend the runway. This is what we are bound to do. We need to extend our runway. Um, upgrade. Construction. Concrete runway. Here we go. All right, so we are 230 tile in length. Let's see what we get when we go on one more. 
Movie Dooley, did you see how many? Two, four, six. Let's do that again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven more aircraft types were added. Well, let's let's go all the way, shall we? I mean, why not, right? If we're going to go, let's go 260. Um, I don't think you get any more. But we'll go 260. We'll put a new taxiway in from here to... Um, let's do it this way for now. And then we'll sort this out when we get there. Um, and this is going to take a little while. Uh, also take a little while, I suspect, to clean up this security problem that I've created. So I think I'm going to call it an episode here, ladies and gentlemen, because I, I really don't want you hanging around and, and watching all this stuff going on. And um, So I'll just call it an episode. And in uh, the next episode, which will be episode 48, we will have a 260-foot long runway, and we will actually be able to get extra large aircraft coming in and also we will aim to get if we are able to um, um, some negotiation going with an airline so that's actually quite a lot to look forward to in the next episode so i wish you all very well and i hope you stay well until i catch you again at the gig channel as always from us here at uh, grumpy's international We'll see you all later. Bye-bye.